In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add an image into your note. So it's really easy to add images to your contributions and you can add images that you find on websites or you can add images that you have saved to your desktop. So the first thing I'm gonna do is show you how to add an image from a website. I'm gonna open a new note. Okay, here it is. And I'm gonna add some new information into this note. So these are all the parts of the leaf and I want to add a diagram that I found earlier into the body of this note. So I found this diagram online. So what I'm going to do is go and search for it again. So what you want to do is go uh, up to your browser and open a new window. And this way you'll be able to search for your images and work with the images in one window and then keep knowledge for them up and work with it in another window. Okay, so I just want to do a basic image search, so I'll just go to Google. And I'll Google their diagram of a leaf. And I'm going to click here to see the image gallery. Now I'm looking at all these images, and it's this one here, the first one that I want to use, so I'm going to click on it. And now I'm just gonna move this window over a little bit because I wanna be able to see my knowledge form note. Okay, so now all I have to do is click and hold in order to drag this image from the gallery here over into my knowledge form note. Okay, so I'm just gonna release. And I see that image was just copied and pasted into um, the body of my note here. Now, if I click over, I can change the size of this image make it bigger or smaller depending on what I want. And that's it. That's how you can embed an image um, from a website into your knowledge form note. Also, I'm gonna delete this. I can also add images into this note that I have saved on my desktop or saved anywhere on my computer. And to do that, I use the attachment feature that's just underneath the scaffolds and the keywords here on the left. Um, and you just click on the button here and it'll ask you to either choose a file from your from your computer um, or you can drag and drop that file here if you have it saved onto your desktop. So I have an image that I've saved onto my desktop and I'm just going to drag it into the shaded area here. And I can see that it's uploaded successfully because I can see a little thumbnail of it right there. Um, now of course it doesn't really do much good over here on the left, we can't really see it, so I'm just gonna go drag and drop it in here. And I wanna click on it to make it bigger. Okay. So there's no limit of um, the amount of images that you can have stored in a knowledge form note. So for instance, this image is always gonna be here and available for me to use in this note. I can attach more than one image if I like, so if I wanna put another diagram, um, I'm gonna, attach this, I'll drag it into this section here, and I can see it's uploaded, see it's here for me and available, so I'll just drag it over into the body of my note, make it a bit bigger. So while you have that extra step of having to drag it into the body of your note, you do have, you can build up this inventory of attachments. Um, and these don't only have to be images, these attachments can be documents, uh, they can be PDFs, okay, it's it, anything that you can attach, just like you would a regular email, you can attach to a knowledge form note and they'll be available for you here. Okay, so that's how you um, embed images into a knowledge form note.